Hello, everybody, and welcome back, back to Diablo 3. I am Rufal, playing this game for you. Woo! All right, let's, uh, not dilly-dally. Let's head back to the passage to Gordovus. Ooh. Find a free sh shrine on the way in. Lorath, this is as far as you go. Catch up to me when it is done. You're going to kill her, aren't you? I will do what is right. We are all counting on you. I don't really understand why we're dismissing Lorath, but, uh... After all, it's not like he can, he can actually stop us from, uh... From, from killing Adria. He has much to answer for. Besides, clearly, we haven't even found Adria yet. That was in there, but it didn't hold up well with that slam. yet. Do you even know where there is yet? It's not over here. That's That much has been learned. Denied. 
Ah, punks. Aha. That's a lot of junk. Let's see where you've been hiding, Balthiel. Adria. The angels will never suffer us to live. They cannot accept the fact that we may choose our own path. At least demons are not so rigid in their beliefs. what I can to ensure it. He always finds a way. In your heart of hearts, you know this. Hmm. The gears. She didn't want to talk much. Before she died, Adria conjured an image of pandemonium. She was searching for Malthea, so he must be there. Right. I need to go back. Guess this is one for Tyrael. Hmm. Sure seems like Adria was spoiling for a fight. This was a fine city before the attack. I wish you could have seen it. Cormac always wanted to bring me here. Probably shouldn't bring that up with him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, probably not. Cormac's still quite upset about what's come to pass. Hey there, Shen. How are you doing? Oh, Duchess was possessed by an all-consuming rage. Oh. As Zai had stolen what was most valuable to Duchess, he would take from Zai all that he held dear. Mm. I would have killed him. <laughs> Duchess took something much more dear than Zai's life. His joy. He killed everyone Zai had loved and held dear. Oh. Then he slew Diria. Her light went out from the heavens, the seas wept, and the waves of the tears crashed upon the shore. Mm. 
Uh, I bet that taught <gasps> my lesson. Hey, Miriam. See? Aren't you happy I didn't tell you beforehand that Adria would turn into a hideous monster? Why would that possibly make me happy? You're so much more effective when you're stewing in blind rage, thirsting for revenge. We wouldn't want you to peak too early. Petty details would have just served to distract you. I suppose I can't argue with that. I was separated from the other soldiers and surrounded by the dead when I saw him. I gazed into the face of death himself. Oh yeah? I couldn't move. I just stared as he passed through me. His touch was like ice, so cold. But something in me changed. Something I cannot understand. Hmm. Kira's newly established rule over Westmarch did nothing to quell the civil war, which continued until she was driven mad and eventually killed by the plague. Cornelius, grandson of Justinian III and slave to the Zacharum faith, used this opening to crush the rebels once and for all and become the new king. A little bit taken aback by the uh, fact that I still have a couple of things that are uh, not level 70. I have some good news. Good news? I mentioned what you did to some guards I met. You could get a commendation or something when this is all over. Oh, that's uh, fantastic. <laughs> this disaster will make for great reading someday. Uh, I don't want to hear your rantings and hopings. Malthale is in Pandemonium. No doubt he has gone to the fortress. Malthale can hold out there until the end of time. He is forcing us to come to him. He is a coward, hiding until he has enough power to confront me. <laughs> the only way to Pandemonium is through the high heavens. Let us leave at once. All right, then. What is this? Oh, you noticed, did you? Malfael is my brother. I fought a thousand battles by his side, and I care not that he seeks to destroy you and your kind. I noticed. But my brother has grown sick, and he must be put down for his own sake. But I have not the heart to do this. And so it falls to you. Come, Nephilim, to Pandemonium. Well, okay then. Malthael tried to stop me from entering Pandemonium, but nothing will keep me from him. Now I will cross these battlefields where angels and demons once fought. I must find the Pandemonium Fortress where the Angel of Death waits for me. I will show him what death means. want you to follow him. I don't like this. <laughs> there is a siege camp not far from here. Meet me there and I will show you what must be done. Very well. Not enough fury. 
ravages were among the most fearsome soldiers of them. Having grown accustomed to the taste of war, they remained in pandemonium. Must I do everything for you? outposts in the battlefields. They may not be the most powerful of their kind, but they are clever and insidious, and no strangers to war. The ancients smile on me. Patience is not one of my virtues, never. Uh, keep talking like your big stuff. I still don't believe it. If he was so impatient, he would just clear up. He would just clean out the way a before me, so he wouldn't have to wait for me. But no, no. Do you see the battering ram below? That is the only way you can breach the fortress gates. Mm. But it is useless without the siege runes that power it. You have one in your possession, but there are two more. I see. You will find them on the battlefield below, in prison along with the demons that carried them. Once you have the runes, go to the ram. Right. But know this, Nephilim. Even if you release Malthael from his madness, I will not thank you for it. I do not want your thanks. <laughs> you imperious is for you to stay out of my way at least until the task is done <laughs> So than the scavengers who armor themselves in the very rocks beneath their feet. They may appear as mighty giants to their foes, but a few hard strikes will reveal I that need their fury. form is much smaller. Not all of the hazards of pandemonium lie above ground. The tunnelers roam just beneath the surface, breaking through to snatch prey in their enormous jaws. And my heroic friends ask why I wish to stay inside the fortress. <laughs> so to answer a question you may or may not have, yes, Deckard Kane has been to the Pandemonium Fortress. Pandemonium is the Alpha and the Omega of the Eternal Conflict. It lies at the center of all things, linking the realms of heaven and hell. Long ago, when the angels were young, the aspect of wisdom found the eye of Anu here. Not enough fury. He made it the world stone, and all of heaven swore to protect it. Yes, the Pandemonium Fortress served as the home base for Act 4 in Diablo 2. Blows. 
Somewhere around here, here will be the uh, Crag of Eternity, which is where one of those rune stones is going to be. Aha! And here we have the other rune stone, which is just kind of a ra randomly uh, walked away. I need fuel. Alright, that's one down. Gotta find the other one. This is an upgrade. Hopefully I'll be able to remember that. Of the cycle of victory and defeat is the foundation of our existence and the essence of the eternal conflict. That thing you pull shooting stars from the sky. Best to kill it before it drops on our knees. <laughs>
else wants some? Especially, anyway. Back to hell, dog. This looks relevant. Sometimes there just simply will be no peace. I need to go back. Alrighty. So, 
junk. So much of it. Salvage this in order to free up those gems. Thought on what you said, and you may have been right. Can't bear the thought of another friend's death. Then you must bear the burden of a lonely life, and it is just as heavy, Hadrian. I suppose so. <laughs> We can't start to rebuild until we know that the one who caused this devastation is dead. I am still searching for him. I swear to you, he will pay. I hope so. <laughs> I've met a lot of these people before. Alrighty. Let's uh, actually continue before we divert into side questing. Don't really have time for that right now, so uh, let's get these siege runes to the ram. <gasps> Makes me appreciate our world even more. <laughs> After a bit, I can see that. Soul Stone to capture all demonic essences, even those that linger in human hearts. If the stone is altered to rip the demonic essence out of every man, woman, and child on Sanctuary, they will all die. We can still stop him. We need to attack the fortress. Now Vale is fundamentally altering the Black Soul Stone. It will now pull in all the demonic essence from whatever plane of existence it finds itself in. But mankind is born of angel and demon alike. Every mortal, save myself, has demonic essence as an intrinsic part of their being. Losing that will rip their body and soul apart. Well then. You know what? We'll take action against Malfail next time. See you then. Later. <laughs>